Hey guys, it's Heather the Crochet Witch. How are you guys doing today? Straighten up my hat. <laughs> um, this, by the way, is just my spiral slouchy hat that I um, usually make in the two colors. It's still in two colors. This one is the green and is just a, the green and purple is a self striping yarn. It's um, one of the newer facet yarns from Michaels. Um, the one that I said looks witchy. I think it's juniper or something. But um, it's those stripey colors with gray. Just a gray. Karen Simply Soft, I think. Um, and yeah, anyway. So that's the hat, just in case. I think it looks really cool. So I had to wear it today. So it's in a, I was in a hat mood. I had an awful hair day. <laughs> um, so here we are. Um, hi. Hello, welcome to the channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining me. Um, you may see my little fuzzy co-host. I think he's peeking right now, actually. Maverick is... Maverick's right there. Oh, Maverick's right here. Hi. You want to come say hi? Say hello, everybody. Say hi. I had to keep my mommy company because she about to do a video. Oh, aren't you? You keeping me company? Such a good boy. He's my little baby. Um, if you're new here, Maverick's my child. <laughs> um, anyway, um, what do I have for you? So this video was supposed to come out for you yesterday, for me still today, because you know how my crazy time works in Heatherland. It's still Sunday night. It's still Easter for me. So happy Easter. I hope you guys had an amazing Easter. Um, I had just... I had made the thumbnail. What are you doing? Mav? What are you doing? Come here. Come here. One moment. Sorry about that. My fuzzy co-host decided to find something on the floor that was crunchy and to eat it. This child eats like a goat. I swear, I thought I was getting a puppy. I was getting a small goat. Huh, you small goat, huh? Anyway, um, what was I even saying, guys? That totally distracted me. I hope you had a really great Easter, if I didn't already say that, or if that's what I was saying. Um, we had a quiet one. Uh, I didn't do much. David didn't do much. We don't do a lot for Easter anyway. Like my parents in law, um, usually do like for like Christmas and Thanksgiving and stuff. They usually do like a family dinner. They didn't even do that for Easter. Um, so not to downplay the holiday, just we didn't, it was a chill, you know, day because David works tomorrow and everything. Um, and it was my first day off in my weekend. So just kind of relaxing. He's getting in like the last of his relaxing. I was getting in the beginning of mine. Um, and we went out to eat uh, and had our own like Easter lunch. Um, and that's, yeah, just I crocheted. Um, I went to see a movie with one of my friends because since that's always open. Um, Anna, my friend Anna and I went to a movie. Um, we saw Late Night with the Devil. I don't know if any of you are horror fa fans who have seen like the previews or if you've seen the movie. Um, it was pretty good. Her and I both liked it. Um, we didn't either one of us think it was like terribly scary, but it had some like creep moments and it, it was good. Um, I will say it was worth watching at least once. And I like watching stuff like scary movies in the theaters myself. So I don't know if you guys agree, but I feel like it makes a scary movie a little scarier just to have like, I guess the loud volume and the giant screen and I don't know. Anyway, so I want to see that. Um, I have, I've got two things in the mail recently. One, let me see. I haven't actually, I like I opened the envelope, so obviously I know what it is. I haven't opened the crinkly bag. It comes in. How well is it sealed? Yeah, it's going to be one I have to tear open. Um, but it's 
Do you remember when I said I had looked at that ice yarn and tried to find a match for this yarn that I've had since I started like knitting and then crocheting? Um, this is a Premier Sweet Roll. Premier Sweet Roll. And I had bought two of these from like Joann's back in the day. And as soon as I realized two wasn't enough, I went back for more and they were already like discontinuing this color. Like Premier Sweet Rolls are still around to this day and, and have evolved as to several different forms. There's like the Frosties and things like that. Um, but this color was gone. Uh, the color is Root Beer Pop. But look at that. Look at the colors. Look at the colors, you guys. Um, one of you lovelies, uh, I talked about this in my ice yarns video, and one of you lovelies let me know that eBay had one, which I have scoured like Etsy, eBay, etc., um, and had no luck. I immediately went to eBay and looked, and they had it happened to be a or best offer auction, so I gave them a price that I was more comfortable with. And uh, they accepted it like right away. So I'm pretty happy about that. Um, I just love these colors. Like I said, this one's called Root Beer Pop. If you ever see any of these, you could always feel free to let me know. <laughs> because I, I would like more, but like now three feels better than two to make something, obviously. Um, but I would like to make like a blanket and I would definitely need more than that. <laughs> But look at these beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colors. They're so pretty. I am in love with them. So I'm pretty excited to share that I found one more. <laughs> they do exist out there. I feel like I'm, I'm stuffy, like my voice sounds a little bit different. I apologize for that. Um, I know I'm sleepy. Hi, are you coming back? Don't find anything else on my floor. So I thought I had it pretty well vacuumed in here, too. I usually don't get a lot besides fiber on the floor anyway in here, but he found something. <clears throat> anyway, um, so yeah, I have that. I have, I'm going to do the Stranger Things stuff that I bought separate. We're going to do like a Stranger Things video. Um, the other thing I got in the mail, without showing addresses... I did cut it open up here, but otherwise we're going to open this together. Um, you know I'm a huge fan of Ellie Leva's stitch marker sets, her advent calendars. Um, I got the Easter one. Like, she's so love, lovely e lovely e Lovingly? No. She's a lovely person. <laughs> I just wanted to use the word lovely somehow, I guess. She's a lovely person, and she so nicely, kindly sent me... Um, the stitch markers. I, my words are like gone today. <laughs> um, I cut it open. So let's open this bad boy together. And since technically yesterday for you guys again, yesterday was Easter. Um, we're going to open more than one of these. Uh, we'll still, I'm not going to open the whole bag, but we'll still open some of them, uh, today. Oh, there's a, okay. Here's the card and look at the little bunny. Isn't he cute? She cute? They, aren't they cute? It's super soft too because it's one of those like little foamy stickery things. Maverick, what you doing? Oh, you just laying down? Okay, he's okay. He's like, for once I'm not doing anything, mom. Hi, Heather. Thank you so much for your order. Enjoy your stitch markers. Have a beautiful and blessed happy Easter. Take care. Hugs, Ellie. Thank you, Ellie. Now, if you're not familiar, I do have all of Ellie's, like, social media down below. Um, I'll probably use the same thumbnail for this video that I use for opening, like, whenever I open some stitch markers since they're Easter-themed. And I was super proud of the thumbnail that I made for this video. <laughs> um, just, it's silly, I know, but... Um, but if you're not familiar with her, like I said, I have her social media down below. And you should know that she always decorates for, like, I was going to say for Easter, but for the holiday, like, so well. She has, she usually sends um, a stitch marker holder and then, like, goodies that go with it and, like, some type of, like, a um, confetti type thing or something. Here is a foam egg right here 
to seal it shut, which I guarantee you I'm about to rip. I did that with the last set too. Oh, maybe not. Is it about to just come open? I got it, you guys. I'm gonna stick it to the top of the bag so I don't, so I don't. Let's see what we got. Okay, that's, I believe, yep, that's a bracelet with these beautiful, there's big white beads in between these beautiful like pearlescent, uh, very Eastery colors. I love that. Oh my gosh, get over my rings. How about that, you guys? Um, oh, that's adorable. Here's one of the little extra y things that. How cute is this carrot? That's so cute. I love it. So we have like a little carrot. There are things like these glittery, very glittery Easter eggs that are just like, I think they're just foam inside. Let me grab that before Maverick comes and decides to eat it. Sorry. Um, and here is the stitch marker holder. Is that all the different little goodie extras in here to show you? Let me see, let me see. Just kind of jumbling through. I think so. I think we're just into numbered packages. Yes, okay. So the, here's the stitch marker holder. What do we got on here? Oh, cuteness. Okay, so like the stitch marker holder is as it sounds. Like there are, are loops, hooks, whatever for your stitch markers to go. And then there are these three beads and the middle one has a cute little chick. Isn't that cute? I love it. I can't get over this cute little carrot. That's the cutest thing. I love that. Okay, anyway, sorry. Um, if I were a little better prepared, I would have opened it in advance and found day one. But let's see, I found two. Let's just do that to remove some of the crinkle. So for those of you who are not the fans of it, let's see, we found day three. So I see 15, so it goes up to day 15. It's 4, 14. One. So 1, 2, 3, 4. What number are you? 10, 11. 9, 13, 12, 8, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let's do six of them. Which, by the way, too, um, just fair warning, I guess, but um, today is now, I know I said like it's still my Easter, but I mean, officially, and by the time you're seeing this, it's going to be. April 1st. Happy April Fool's Day, by the way. Um, and it's also, for those of you who follow along with such things like I do, the beginning of Mercury Retrograde. <laughs> Which, if you are familiar, you know a lot of things tend to go haywire, get lost in transmission, bad luck association, kind of. Um, I don't want to say bad luck, but just things tend to get stressful and crossed and protect yourself out there against mercury retrograde you guys but it does officially start today um also yes on the 8th uh which is monday next like a week from today um the uh solar eclipse happens i'm very excited about that i can't wait to see it um to experience it again um i hope that it, i do <laughs> i hope it's not cloudy or anything um and then what I have, that's a Monday, and by Wednesday, Maverick has his ear surgery for the, the lump in his ear. So, good vibes, please. Hopefully, everything goes well there. But let's open some stitch markers, right? These all have the, like, foam, not all, 
but they they mostly are decorated with the foam cutouts like here's a cute bunny and these are so soft i love feeling them but ellie decorates everything so beautifully well um she thinks of like everything like i was starting to mention when i said i have her information linked down below for you oh my god that's a cute way to start it first of all before i show you the charm there's beautiful pinks in here and here is an easter egg with a bunny how adorable is he oh my gosh i love him so that is day one and then we have day two, which is the exception to the foam stickers. But here is, there's like an Easter egg on the front. It's tissue paper that has cute little Easter bunnies, Easter eggs, etc. And Heather's having a difficult time opening today. This one almost looks um, like handmade because it's not like like those are charms. This has the pearl bead and a seed bead or two going down it. And then look, there's like, I don't know how to describe it, like a handmade Easter charm. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It's like a, a pretty big disc. It's bigger than a quarter. It's like a half dollar size if you're familiar. And like there's a Easter egg, a decorated glittery pretty Easter egg right there. That's a good sized stitch marker too. Like you're not gonna lose that. <laughs> That's really pretty and cool. I, I was saying pool, I, I don't know what I was doing. My brain is doing weird things today. So here is day three with another soft, really soft, cute bunny. I love the feel of these like sticker foam things. They're so nice. There's a wooden charm on some spring with some spring color beads on each side. And the wooden charm is a painted Easter egg. Isn't that beautiful? I love it. Oh, you got some good ones this time. I mean, she always does, but I've got some good ones. Here's day four. If I can get my finger in there to hold it up with another of the... This one's standing up, but he's a little... Um, soft foamy guy again and look at like all of them have such like pretty pastel colors too like they're just they're beautiful the wrapping job alone is like a work of art <gasps> oh my god it's another charm and it's what I I have to assume or is now going to be a carrot cake piece with a little bunny eating the carrot <laughs> look at that little chubby bunny isn't he adorable? Oh my gosh, I think this one's my favorite so far. I love him. I love him. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. <laughs> that's my favorite so far. Here is day five with another very soft bunny, foam bunny sticker. And it's beautiful, like purpley, pastel-y purple. Um, Tissue paper. <gasps> more bunnies! More bunnies! I love, I love bunnies, you guys. This has an orange Easter egg that says Happy Easter. And there are some really pretty colored seed beads here on top of it. And just beads, I guess. There's a bigger one too. And then there's two little adorable bunnies hiding out. Look how cute! And these colors, by the way, are Detroit Tiger colors, which, FYI, that is my favorite team ever. Let's go Tigers. I love it so much. Maybe that's my... No, I think the cake is still my favorite. I love the bunnies, just period. And the last one we'll do today is day six, and it is in the, uh, the pretty bunny and egg decorative paper. Oh, oh, I 
love this. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. Maybe this is my favorite. Okay, so there are, let me show you the pretty beads first and foremost. There are pretty beads right there. And then look at the mushroom and how cute that little mushroom toadstool is. Oh my gosh. I know mushrooms are like pretty popular right now. It seems like in some, for some places or whatever. Um, but I have recently realized how many like mushroom things and toadstool things were on like older vintage. Like they had it in like the cookware, on um, clothes. I remember when I was a, a kid and it was old it was something old when I was a kid, but it, there I had a patch on one of my jeans or whatever that was mushrooms. Um, there's just mushrooms everywhere, and they're very like a very vintagey thing, and I love it so much. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That is so cute. Very excited. Let me grab my stitch marker holder, and I am going to put these on it. So I don't lose anything. Um, Ellie has, she always seems to outdo herself. I mean, really. These are all so stinking cute. Let me get that there. I think it's just that I'm tired. Cause like my, um, my motor function seems not like open stitch marker. <laughs> Focus, Heather. <laughs> I can't get over how cute some of these bunnies are and the, the mushroom. Oh my gosh, it's cute. sure what Ellie has coming up next as far as her themes and such but yeah like just check her out and you will see you can see for yourself and contact her if you need to if you want to if you desire to oh my gosh these are so so cute i'm so happy i got these even though we'll be opening them after easter i'm so happy i got these so here is the stitch marker so far that's quite a like eclectic pretty collection so far too right oh my gosh i love them so thank you so much ellie i really do love these um i think uh, update on the Michaels. Remember I said I had a Michaels haul for you because I ordered that part of my order while I was waiting on the order. I got, um, I went shopping at Michaels and then I've, I had still been waiting on the other part of my order to show you guys. Um, I had to contact them because it just said label printed for like ever. So they have reissued and reshipped out my, um, yarn. So hopefully that will be here soon. Um, I placed a, a teeny, teeny, teeny premiere order. And I'm not even going to lie. I've been thinking hard about another ice yarn order. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see about that one. Um, but yeah, other than that, uh, I think I'm going to let you guys go. Like, and... I will just see you next time because my words are failing me. My brain is pausing way too often. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm just going to go and I'll see you soon. <laughs> All right. I love you guys. Bye guys.